Self-nurturing is far more than pampering. It is about returning home to your heart. But pampering yourself is nice too. Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am Discover Yogi and I'm back with another episode of Self Care Sunday where we explore different tips to help you take better care of yourself. So today's self care tip is to pamper yourself. Yes, take some time out to pamper yourself. So this tip is probably what people really associate self care with. When most people think of self care, they think of physically slowing down or the physically rewarding things that they can do such as getting a manicure or a pedicure. It's kind of like a reward for your body for everything that you do. So there are many ways to pamper yourself such as getting a manicure and pedicure as I stated or you can get your hair done or your makeup done or get a facial, a massage or even taking a hot bath. And there are many other things that you can do but I want to know in what ways do you pamper yourself? Let me know down in the comments. So the thing about pampering yourself is that you'll always feel good afterwards. All of these activities either help you to look better or feel better. And if you look good, you feel good. And if you already feel good, you'll feel even better afterwards. Pampering also gives you time to relax and not having to do something. It allows you to be on the receiving end instead of giving all the time. And pampering is not just for women. Men can do the same things. Remember that self-care is for everyone and we all need it and that self-nurturing is more than pampering. It's about returning home to your heart. And that's it, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to tap the bell so that you can be notified when I upload new videos. And remember, I'll be back every other Sunday with another episode of Self Care Sunday.